Hello, my name is Andrew Parker, aka Ibercat Andrew, aka Ophelia, aka Spider Man, and we all know at this point that I'm a big Marvel fan, specifically Spider Man. And just so everyone knows, this is in your in game spoiler alert. I have seen it four times now, and if you have not seen it, shame upon you. This trailer that we're about to watch has in game spoilers in it, and if you've seen in game, feel free to comment down below about in game. I will be responding. I won't be deleting any in game spoilers because the spoiler ban has been lifted. So if you haven't seen it, it's on you now. I wasn't gonna watch this, but I've had so many people tell me that a lot of interesting things happen in it, and it explains some things about why this movie is happening and when it's happening, I think, maybe. And like I said, it has some in-game spoilers in it, so it kind of relates to in-game. And I'm kind of curious as what's happening with the MCU after this. And it just seems like a pretty interesting trailer uh, that people have asked me to watch, so we're gonna watch it. The Spider-Man Far From Home trailer is about to play, but if you haven't seen Avengers Endgame yet, stop watching because there's some serious spoilers about this British up. accent. But if you it's have great. seen Avengers Endgame, enjoy the trailer. Oh, I've seen it. Oh, I've seen Everywhere it, baby. Everywhere I go, I see his face. I just really miss him. Yeah, I miss him too. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. <laughs> You gonna be the next Iron Man now? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your jobs. Oh. Oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Look, keep up the good work because I am going on vacation. So he made me cry and then up. he roasted some call. police officers. I don't really want to talk to Nick Answer Fury. Phone. Why? Because if you don't talk to him, then I have to talk to him. I don't want to talk to him. You sent Nick Fury to voicemail? I gotta go. You do not ghost Nick Fury. What up, dorks? What's up? We're you don't decline Nick Fury. I'm here don't in St. Marco Polo. Oh, I think MJ really likes me. That reminds me when I first fell in love. MJ. But it's You're not Mary very Jane, I've heard. You're a difficult person to contact, Spider-Man. What a savage. This is Mr. Beck. We could use someone like you on my world. Your world? Beck is from Earth, just not ours. The snap to our hole in our dimension. You're saying there's a multiverse? We have a job to do. And you're coming with us. Yo, we got multiverse up in here? There's gotta be someone else you can use. What about Thor? Off world. Captain Marvel. Unavailable. But Iron Man. The neighborhood Spider Man. He's gone. Ooh, stealth suit. Bitch, please. You've been to space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's great. I want to go back on my trip with the girl who I really like and tell her how I feel. MJ, I am Spider-Man. No, of course I'm not. I mean, it's kind of obvious. You're right. You may not be what, but this is my responsibility. Oh, the world classic! Glass ball head. Sometimes people die. He's gonna be bad, right? He's a bad guy. I just always feel like I'm putting my friends in danger. The world needs the next Iron Man. Be Spider-Man. You don't have to be Iron You're Man, going dude. To step up or not? <laughs> what is? Get the guys out of here. Get on the jet. Who are you? I work with Spider-Man. You work for Spider-Man? I work with Spider-Man, not for Spider-Man. New plan. <laughs> Okay, there is a lot in that trailer. There is a lot in that trailer. See, there's some super epic moments that I just watched that I'm not gonna watch in the. I'm not gonna see for the first time in the. the I'm not gonna see for the first time in theaters now. This is why I don't watch them. I'm still glad I watched it. Yeah, definitely some spoilers in there. Uh, his relationship with Tony is one of the most heartbreaking things ever. If you watch Spider-Man: Homecoming and the way Tony and him uh, interact, and then in Infinity War. You know, Spider-Man obviously dies and Tony has to watch that, and then in Endgame, Spider-Man has to watch Tony die. I've seen it four times, I bawled my eyes out every single time, so... First part of that was heartbreaking, and then he roasted some police officers, that was funny. Tom Holland is just... pure amazingness in this role. Um, I wasn't the biggest fan of Spider-Man Homecoming. Uh, this one looks epic and awesome, and multiverse, what up with that? And then you gotta deal with that MJ thing. I have no idea what they're doing with that. Apparently that's his love interest. His relationship with Happy in Spider-Man Homecoming was kind of funny because Happy was just annoyed with him the whole movie. But this, in this one, it kind of seems like they're working together better, which is cool. Seems like a pretty epic 
movie, and that kind of got me more excited. You know, when you see Endgame after 11 years of Marvelness, it's like you feel like it's the end and everything's sad. And but you know, the MCU is still going strong. They got a lot of movies coming out, and obviously, I'll still be watching them. So let me know what you thought about this trailer. Let me know what you thought about Endgame. Let me know if you're excited about this movie and if you're gonna go see it. Carpe diem, we to Esmono. Go have a great day. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>